churro latte from Duncan. Okay, today, dripped out. You see me, I stay dripped out. But we're going to see the... Don't do that. It's the same fit I wear every single week. I got an Instagram post of me wearing the same outfit and I don't care. It saves me time. I know what I'm wearing. Period. I wear it every day. Different accessories. Different accessories. It's, it's a different white shirt. It's wrinkly. Yeah. Different socks, of course. Draws is the same. But who cares? Oh. Gonna go get something to eat after that, see some good food. They have a lot of good seafood out here where we live in Florida because we're right by the Gulf of Mexico. So maybe we'll get some seafood. But I'm really curious to see what this flea market looks like. I've never been to one outside of California. And I think they're gonna have a lot of country people there, a lot of farmers. So hopefully they sell us some good stuff. We'll see though. Ain't that we'll right? See. Let's check out your fit before I end the video. <laughs> how much how much was the jeans? They from Sheen. They like. How much was the shoes? A cool How much was the shirt? Like twenty. How much was the little bust down rally? Before we go, I gotta show y'all our new plant. Twenty six dollars. It was worth every penny of it. I'm loving it. Hopefully it don't die. I got it right here by the window so it could get a little bit of sunshine during out the day. <laughs> But I don't know if you could see one, but I don't know where these water droplets keep coming from. It's like they form their own water. Unless you've been watering. Have you been watering my plant? Have you been watering the plant? I've been seeing some drops on it. Which plant? That one? The yeah. That, one? Yeah. No. I asked you. You seen those drops? Yeah, I asked I don't know where those come from. Maybe we could do a little bit of research. It's the plant's way of relieving the pressure buildup in its plant tissues. In fact, the patient is a sign that your monstera plant is healthy. That's where you'll be. That's when I'll that's where I'll be when you get on my fucking nerves again. Straight to that prison. <laughs> As you guys can see, there is a lot of construction going on. The city's on the rise. Oh, see, that's what turned right here. Hold on, is it? This is pretty dope. Hold on. They got planted things. Look, it's what's the name? From the movie. Target. This right here. That's the movie. <laughs> Where did you say a fucking uh, The joke. The commercials. Not plants, y'all. This one, it's hella cool. Yeah. That one is pretty cute. This, this one's really cool like too. got like trunks. Yeah, All they're right. thick. How's it going? Going good. How you doing? Good. Got any Lamborghinis? <laughs> I think I packed them all away already. <laughs> well, How long you been collecting? About 40 some years. So, I made fried tilapia with rice. <laughs> Simple, but requested by the one, the one and only. only. Yeah. Now it is bust down. It needs a little bit of hot sauce. I was trying to see if we got sriracha. Crystal hot sauce would bust with that. Now it works. Duncan hot sauce. Dump a little on the blade. So you just want to kind of give it a little dibble dabble. Like so. Oh my like so. God. Oh my goodness. Thank you, camera. <laughs> I already put Ella in, I already put Ella on there. Oh, you did? Yes. It's just uh, gone. It's spilled all over our kitchen table. So he likes to be over exaggerated. It's spilled all over our kitchen table. Oh. 
Now, for all the females out there that do want to move with their partner, mm -hmm. what would you say to them? Don't no, do that who shit. the fuck you moving with? What's that supposed to mean? Well, I'm just saying, like, people usually don't like to have uncomfortable conversations, so it's good to have those uncomfortable conversations before you move What do in. those uncomfortable conversations look like? What should like, those females be asking? She should be asking, like, what are some things that you grew up in your family that you wouldn't want to or would like to keep when you move together? Because those are important when building foundational skills Moving on with life, because everything's habitual. What so other if it's questions? a bad habit, no. Um, what are some of your pet peeves about me? Or what are some of the pet peeves about you? It's good to know the pet peeves so you're aware when you're and you're considerate when living with your partner because you'd want to treat people how you get treated. Um, don't mind the roughness. We look at rough, we look at rough, but we at <laughs> Duncan. You feel me? Duncan. Zuckin Zonas. It is our fourth year anniversary today. It's <laughs> our anniversary. Hey. Oh, let's play that. It has not they felt like four years. about that time. What they know up? You said it hasn't felt like four years? Nope. What did it feel like? Four days? For real. Four weeks. Yesterday. Tai Chi. Yeah, Ouch. 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 There you go. Let me see that other one. This is his love language, is cracking my knuckles and my toes. Don't say that on camera. <laughs> I think it's the cutest thing ever. I have a thing with cracking knuckles. <laughs> Not you. My turn. Oh. Ooh, that one was crunchy. Okay, ready? <laughs> ready? my toes because I ain't got no socks on. Taste toast. Churro latte from Duncan. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna have to see it. Me too. But made as fuck, bitch. I Florida, Florida, Florida. Made this shit in hell. I'm peeing because I could have made this shit in hell. But yeah, it's not that good. But at least it's like not like you go to Starbucks and you pay like twenty dollars for two drinks. How much was it? Eight dollars. 